Hi, I'm Jillian Jess with MouthpieceSports.com. I'm here with the legendary Moose Scour. Moose, I got to tell you, it's a pleasure to meet you. Nice meeting you. I don't know about legendary, but I wish I was playing today. I'd be a multi-millionaire. You've played with the best. Tell yes, me a little bit about your baseball career. Well, just remember three M's in 1961, Maris, Mantle, and Moose. We had 143 home runs, which is still a record today. We might have had a few beers, but not like what these guys take today. But I hope I, that record's not broken. What was baseball like back then? I mean, you've seen the transition to what it is now. Well, today it's money. You know, you got a lot of TV, you got a lot of sponsors, and I don't blame these guys. If these owners want to give them that kind of money, take it. I mean, A-Rod's getting like $25 million a year. Wouldn't you like to be married to him? Are you still following any teams right now? Yes, ma'am. I work for the Chicago White Sox. I'm in the community relations. They got a good job. I get paid twice a month, and they've been very good to me. You got to experience a World Series with them, but you've experienced them on your own. Yes, I played in eight World Series. Uh, we won five, and I had a Dodger ring when I was with the Dodgers in 1963. I sold it. I got the money and give it to the kids, my sons, and my daughter and my wife got it. So. I wanted to get rid of that ring. I wore the 61 Yankee ring, which was the greatest team that I played with. I got the other ones. I gave each of my sons a ring. I said, if you need the money, sell it. Other, the other rings I've got at home in the, my safe deposit box, and whenever my wife wants to sell them, she can sell them. Well, if you have any extra, I think I could fit one on my well, finger. maybe we'll fix up something. All right, thank you. So yeah. how'd you get involved with this today? We're at Ron uh, well, Kittle's. Ron Kittle's been after me for many years. See, you, usually I go to Yogi Berra's golf tournament, so I'm leaving for Upper Montclair, New Jersey, Sunday afternoon. So and I'll play Monday and then come home Tuesday. You're able to play both. How's your golf game? Lousy. This is the first time I'm going to play today. I can't hit the damn little white ball. I like a high fastball when I was playing, but I'm no upper cutter, so I'm dependent on my partners. It's all about the experience with these guys. That's right. We'll have a good time. I just tell them a few stories, and people pay money, and Ronnie does a heck of a job with this tournament. So can you tell me a story, any, something that nobody else knows? Oh, I can't get it. Are you kidding? Come on. Well, it's just I gonna... told, well, one of my greatest thrills was when Joe DiMaggio was married to Marilyn Monroe. We went out for dinner, her and I and Joe and Tony Kubek, and we had a great time, and she was a beautiful lady. I shaved four times that day. I was so excited to meet her, and she was nice. Wow. Did you take any pictures? No. Just have it all we up here? We were hiding. We were hiding. Did, did you play golf with any of the guys back then? Oh, yeah, I played with Mickey and Yogi. Well, I'll be with Yogi playing in his tournament. I'm not too good in this game, but I go out to have fun, and, and when guys like Kittle run tournaments, we try to help them out. How's Mickey's game? Mickey was a hell of a golfer. He was a par scratch golfer, but he passed away about 12, 13 years ago, and Maris has been gone 20 years. So we're all getting, we're still, I'm still above ground, so everything's turned out fine. You're carrying it on for those guys. I try to, to be nice to everybody. Sometimes you can't make everybody happy, so you hang in there. Well, have fun. You have this one and then Monday, so do you have a lot of going on? I've got on three week? more after this, and I'm done. I hate playing golf. Then I worry about a DUI going home. There was, you said there was only a couple beers involved. That's it, a couple vodka tonics or Bloody Marys, and that's it. Well, have a great time out there, Moose. Like right, I said, again, it's a pleasure you, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Lots of luck. With the legendary, I'm going to call it, Moose Scourin, I'm Jillian Jessk, and you're watching MouthpieceSports.com.